Hey everyone, and welcome to the Mac Cave. Uh, today I'm back with another unboxing for Bambox. Um, this is April 2016's Bambox, and this month's theme is Rest in Peace. So, uh, yeah, uh, it sounds like a cool theme. I'm gonna go ahead and open this thing up and see what we got going on in here. Okay, here we go. What? So there's a Jason mask in here, and it's signed by Ari Lehman. And if you don't know who this guy is, he's actually the first Jason um, that was ever in Friday the 13th. So he was a boy in the lake that jumps out at the end of the movie. So he never actually wore the mask. But uh, if you're a horror fan, you'll know that Ari Lehman's still around. He has a, a band called First Jason, which is awesome. And yeah, he's all about it. So he signed a ton, a ton of these Jason masks uh, to go out to all the Bandbox subscribers. And I was actually there. So. Here's the cool thing, Bambox actually hit me up last month and they decided that they want me to help them out with some of their videos. And I said, sure, of course I would. Super cool dudes. They actually invited me out to go meet Ari Lehman during the signing for these masks and it was one of the coolest things I've ever done. Um, he was a super cool guy, really fun to talk to. I was kind of fanboying out around him like we were just chit-chatting movies. We talked about Gremlins and, and you know Friday the 13th. And he actually signed something that means a lot to me, and it has nothing to do with this band box, which I'll get back to this in a second, but hold on one moment, check this out. Okay, so when I got to go meet Ari Lehman with the band box guys, check this out. I brought one of my, my personal prized possessions because it means a lot to me, with me to that event, and he totally signed it and loved it, so check this out. This is my Camp Crystal Lake sign that was handmade by one of my closest friends on this planet. And she's an awesome artist. She, Bob Ross, the little trees and the birds and everything. This sign's amazing and it's huge. I have this hanging up in my kitchen, but if you look closely, Ari Lehman signed that for me. It says, Jason never dies. Ari Lehman, Jason won. He signed this for me and this hangs up in my kitchen. So, Bambox, thank you so much, guys. Like, I, I, I can't thank you enough for letting me meet that horror icon. And he signed this for me, which means so much because this was just hanging up in there, which is still amazing. But now it's actually signed by him. Maybe one day I'll get it signed by Kane Hodder or something. That'd be so cool. So that's super awesome. I'm extremely happy that that happened. It was such a cool moment for me. I had to take a couple pictures with him and everything. But then he also signed this for me. And apparently this is worth money. I mean, I wouldn't ever sell it because I actually really, really like it. But check this out. So. My Pamela Voorhees NECA figurine that I got from uh, San Diego Comic Con last year. Um, it's in perfect condition. Like, I babied this thing the entire trip. This is pretty much one of the only things I really, really wanted from San Diego Comic Con. This is my Jim Lee Batman back there, the white blueprint version. But, um, yeah, I don't ever plan on selling this. This is mine. I love Friday the 13th. And he signed, Matt, Jason never dies. Right on it. Right over his toy. That is the coolest thing ever. I love it, and he totally made my day, and I, I have this now, and the Camp Crystal Lake sign hanging up in my house. So this was just an awesome experience for me. I can't thank you guys enough for, for bringing me along for that. That was so cool. Okay, back to the band box. Um, so yeah, I was there and I witnessed it, but he seriously signed an Ari Lehman Jason mask for everyone. And there's, there's actually variants out there. Um, there's, there's black ones, there's silver ones, and there's gold ones. It looks like I got a silver one, which is awesome. Um, the, the black ones look so badass though, so if you get a black one, awesome. The gold ones really have a ton of detail on the weathering and such, but yeah, this is a solid mask, and it has a little certificate of authenticity, but this is, I'm gonna hang this up next to the sign, honestly. This is gonna go right next to the sign. I have a giant uh, London 1880 poster from Friday the 13th Part 3, which is personally one of my favorites, even though a lot of people don't like it, but that's when Jason gets his mask, so. This is amazing. Next up here in the band box is uh, Winnie Steel Machete uh, signed by Ari Lehman. So they're actually giving away a real machete that they had signed from Ari Lehman when we were there. It has a Friday the 13th um, badge on it, on the handle, or towards the handle, and then it's signed, I believe it says like, Jason Never Dies, Jason Won, Ari Lehman, which is awesome, right down the blade itself. So make sure to enter to win this contest because I personally want it really bad. I'm gonna enter tonight just because it's amazing, but yeah. Next up in the band box are brass knuckles. <laughs> um, Biohazard zombie survival gear brass knuckles. Uh, 
I don't know what I'm gonna do with some brass knuckles, but this is ridiculous. I don't have any, and these are these are pretty heavy, man. So <laughs> it's like a zombie face or a skull on the brass knuckle. So that's kind of cool. These are actually heavy, and they are brass knuckles. So be careful, kids. Um, yikes. <laughs> Next up in the band box. Oh, this is cool. Oh, so check it out. It's it's got it's like a little Spock plate for Leonard Nimoy, and it says LLAP. So live long and prosper. Um, I don't know if you can see that, but is this metal? Yeah, this is so cool. It's like a, a metal plaque in a way. I mean, obviously you can see through it, but. Uh, that's cool. 1931 to 2015. Damn, that's that's awesome. Next up in the band box, Empire State University student. Oh, it looks like it's a uh, student ID for uh, for Gwen Stacy. And if you didn't know, this is the rest in peace box. So, spoilers. That's awesome. Excelsior. Next up in the band box is our little rest in peace pamphlet. Oh, what? This is awesome. It's a, uh, it's a Joker, like a Joker nurse uh, print. Damn, the colors are cool. So it's signed, it says, bam, two, I got number 212 out of 999. Um, the artist is Christopher Uminga, Uminga? I've never heard of him, but it's awesome. It's like really colorful. So that's cool. Anything Batman related, I'm on board with that. This month is pretty awesome. There's a lot of neat things in there that have to do with the rest in peace. I mean, I'm so stoked on this mask. You have no idea. Uh, this is absolutely ridiculous. Um, yes, I did go with them to go get this sign and that kind of spoiled the mask for me, but that doesn't matter. I'm still super excited. Like I actually have one. So thanks again, guys. So when it comes to the whole band box thing, I'm still subscribed to their box, so I'm still gonna be doing unboxings and such, because I love, I actually like unboxing this and like Loot Crate and everything, it's fun. Um, but they have asked me to start helping them on the side with some stuff, which is really exciting for me, because, I mean, it's it's fun. This is an awesome company, and they're cool dudes, so uh, I'm not gonna be biased at all. I'm still gonna open this up and speak my mind with it. So if you have any questions or concerns or comments, please leave me one below, but I'm gonna be truthful with everything. So. I will be working a little bit with them on the side here, but that's not gonna go ahead and take away from my personal opinion on what's inside the box. So, but I will be back with more content soon. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. We'll see you soon.